the baseball game in San Francisco. I think we're going to watch the Cubs. I mean, I could be completely wrong, but that could be a team from a completely different state. But we're in San Francisco, I'm going to a baseball game, and I've never been to one of them before, so I'm so excited. We're doing a road trip around America. So we're in San Francisco, that's gonna go on my brow at the moment. My skin is so dry from all the traveling, so going in with my, oh, glow barrier, but not barrier builder, hydration era. I love this before makeup so, so much. It makes our skin so like tacky and glowy. It's currently 2.55 and we are gonna be out all night. So I need this makeup to stick and last me a very long time. So the only primer I'm gonna be using for that is Milk Hydro Grip. <laughs> Some people say they struggle with this primer going a bit funny on their skin, but you need to make sure you use enough to coat your entire face and really work it in with your fingers because that's when it's gonna warm up and melt into the skin a lot better. My face is so sticky right now. And guys, are you proud of me? I've actually planned my outfit. So I know what I'm wearing, unlike usual, where I have no clue. Because it's a baseball game, I wanna look quite cool. So I think I'm going with like cargoes, a little white top, and then my represent bomber. I'm so excited, I really want a foam finger. Me and Lucy both said that we really wanna get a really cute pic with our foam fingers. A little pro tip, which I've not done for ages, is after you've put like your privacy moisturizers on, spray your face with setting spray. I used to do it all the time, and Josie, you've all seen Josie, she's reminded me to start doing it again because it's gonna add like extra layer of grip and lasting power. Of course, using Glow Milk Mist. I'm going in with my MAC Dewy Strobe Tint because I never not use it. Like, this is one of the products which is a staple in my makeup bag. So, if you need a new staple product to just whack on your face, even out your skin tone, and give you a glow, it's this. It is this. I've literally come back early to get ready, so I'm not late, but obviously I want to be late. So I want to be glowy like a disco ball, so I don't want anything at too full coverage. So I'm going in with the Pat McGrath. What is this called? It's called the Skin Fetish Foundation. It's so light. It makes your skin look like a little silky, glowy dream. A little bit goes such a long way. I like to work it in with my fingers first and do most of the work, the warmth of my finger. Then I'll go in with my sponge to like press it into the skin. Then go in with a damp marshy and just press that product into the skin and it just wait, it looks like that. Yeah, I still have quite a lot of product left, so really, I only needed like one pump. I'm also going to use some of the new products that I got from Sephora today, because I've been dying to use them. So I've got some blushes, some new highlighters. Oh my God, have you seen that Pink Honey are bringing out Cake Contour, I think it's called, which are like contour shades, because these are all, of course, like cream bronzers. Oh my God, they're bringing out contour. I am so excited. I cannot wait to get home and order some. Mm. I've really been loving this Mario Sculpting brush to really... Oh, hello Jason, that is very loud. I feel like that's just been turned off. Anyway, before I was interrupted by Jason Derulo, I've really liked this Mario sculpt and it's like a jewel and cream bronzer brush. And I just love this little dumpy side for a nose contour. And then I use this side for my cream bronzer. Blush, I'm gonna mix together Charlotte Tilbury's Peach Pop and my Made by Mitchell Imposy Rosy. So, oh, did you hear that noise? That was so satisfying. I'm gonna just, oh God, that was a lot. Pop that on there. My fingers are already covered, so I'm just gonna use my fingers to mix that together to make like a little sunsetty, peaky, peaky, pinky, peachy vibe. Mitchell MF4 brush, I promise, Mitch. I will start using my new one soon. Mitch kindly bought me a new one of these at Mitchell Mart because basically I dropped perfume all over these brushes, like a whole bottle of perfume leaked in my bag, all on brushes, and destroyed them. Those two blushes melted together, like, look. This as a cheek is like my dream matte peachy cheek. If I want glowy, then of course I'm gonna use my glow milk blush, but right now, I like this. I'm just arrived back. Tell them all what you and Tom are doing tonight. In baseball socks. So, because we're going to a baseball game, we've both just come back with loose and said that they're going to get, like, not matching, but both baseball tops and they can wear a baseball top in the game. With our lucky numbers on the back of them. With their lucky numbers on. Like it's so cute. Yeah, yeah, like that. <laughs> I'm literally obsessed with the Anastasia Magic Touch Concealer. That's what I've got under my eyes right now. It just makes my under eyes look really airbrushed. The Magic Touch one, and I use the shade 4. I love doing this part of my concealer where I really like wing it up there so that it really gives my face like a lift. I love this song. I love you right now. I look better under you. I can't lose. Okay, it's 23 minutes past. We're leaving at four. I need to hurry up because I need to curl my hair. Have those cheekbones on. 
Okay, I feel like it's only right that we're gonna try, oh, try the new House Labs. It's the Powder Sculpt Velvet Bronzer. I did a little haul and showed it to you. I'm gonna use my Nude Cosmetics brush because I love this so much for bronzer. Oh, it does feel really nice on the skin. It's going on like a little dream. Okay, no, this bronzer is fire. I think I found a new bronzer. It goes on the skin, it's so buttery. It just lays on top of everything perfectly. It's a House Labs um, face day because I'm gonna use the Pomelo Peach blush because it's just, it's just another level of blush. It is stunning. If you can get your hands on these, pick them up. It's just one of the most perfect blushes I have ever worn. Like, look at them cheek. I said it's a house of space day. We're gonna use this new, what it's actually called, the Bio Radiant Gel Powder Highlight. So it's in the shade Rose Quartz. I'm sorry, stop, stop, stop. Look at that. Oh my God. Are you seeing that? Right, this side, this side. Oh my God. I am so glad I got this. It looks like I've applied like a liquid highlighter. Now I don't usually like powder highlighters, they're not for me. Because I really think they exaggerate texture and show up like your pores and things. But this, it must be because it's like the gel, the bio gel bonanza. This is just what I want a product to do. Last piece of the puzzle, let's try this Rare Beauty highlighter that I have never tried before. It's in the shade Enlighten. Really always tells me how good this is. I'm sure Grace has told me how good this is as well. Wow, wow, she is glowing. The book. Oh, the lights died. I propped my iPhone light up on my other phone on the mirror, so let's see. It's given us a little bit of extra light, but oh, that is so nice. So I was saying, on the bum of a damp beauty sponge is how I press in all of like my gel liquid highlighters. Trust me, it makes them go on like a dream and makes your skin look like glowy skin rather than you've got highlighter on. But everything is just looking so cute right now. Look at that nose, it looks so cute, like a little pixie. You see the glow? Oh, this is all so pretty. I seriously need to be ASAP Rocky now because I need to do my lips and curl my hair. Set everything in place with my Glow Milk Seal and Set. So we get a glow, but everything is locked in place. Okay, take these out. I mean, hair does look like cute like this. I did wear it like this earlier, but I've not worn my hair down for ages because it's been dirty. Let me just flick this up on my head. Oh, perfect. Does anyone else do that straight and over their hair before they curl it? Because I literally do that most times if I've not like just blow dry my hair and I need to curl it. Okay, the curls are curling. I'm gonna set them. I'm just using this Beauty Works hair spray. I use Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Liner on my lips. And now for actual lip gloss, because we're in a gloss era, I don't know what to use. I don't know whether to use Turkish Delight by NARS or whether to use Fenty Sweet Mouth. I might mix them, why not? Let's put a bit of NARS Turkish Delight on. <gasps> oh yeah, that is so pretty. I'm gonna do a little bit of Sweet Mouth by Fenty. I don't know whether I should have just gone straight in with this one, but hey ho. Oh, that is so nice. I mean, I have used these glosses before, I just don't think I have Sweet Mouth. Please brush these curls out and then I need to get changed. So, quickly got changed and I redid my hair. Sam is in his little t-shirt. And now we're going, gonna go meet Tom and Lucy downstairs and we're going to the baseball game. Yay! If you want to see my full outfit, go and look over on my Instagram. I will have posted a picture of it on there. Bye!